Hello everybody, Nephilim JD here, and welcome back to Donkey Kong Country. Last time we completed the first two worlds. I mean, that's pretty good headway, I think, yeah. But now we're going to be heading into Vine Valley. Vulture Culture, the first level. Yeah, I haven't been saying all the names of the levels because... I just... I don't... F you can read. I hope you can read, at least. I mean, some people can't. You know, for various reasons, and that's okay. Nothing wrong with that. You know, you might, you might be five years old, I don't know. So, you might not have a complete understanding of the English language, and that's fine. You know, you don't need to... There we go, I was wondering if there was a secret there. There had to be. Oh, I don't like this minigame. It takes forever. And it's stupid. It's stupid. I'm being petulant. There we go. I don't care if we finish it or not. Two, three, four, yeah! Okay. But yeah, I'm not... I'm not one of those that are like, we're going to this level, name level here. Not that there's anything wrong with Let's Play that do that, it's just not me. I just want to get going and get it done. I don't want to waste a lot of time just talking about... Uh, I'll talk about the game, you know, like, there's vultures in this game. Okay, I talked about the game enough. Uh, you know, I'm still trying to figure out how to talk. And that sounds weird, I know, but I mean, like, what? How did... Uh, what? I... What the be? You just saw that, right? So I opened that. But I, I did like that, and it closed it immediately. That is... That is dumb. But yeah, I'm still trying to figure out how... What topics to talk about, if at all. And... You know... Just, just in general, how to talk. You know, I don't need to talk about this game all the time. Yeah. Not gonna say the title of that stage. Okay. Now... There's the vulture. Do this and we get a bonus. Yeah. Ooh. I don't care. <laughs> I'm just gonna skip through it because, you know, I don't even know why I'm doing this. Why am I? Why am I? Whoops! That was way too soon. Um, I'm I'm good at video games, right, guys? Yeah. I know exactly what I'm doing. Yeah, I shouldn't even do the bonuses, really. I mean, unless they're just there, but if they're out of the way, I'm not gonna really, I'm not gonna really go out of my way to. Oh, I hate these kinds of screens where it's like it doesn't push completely to the right. You know, it doesn't the screen doesn't? Uh, I, I don't know how to explain it. It's like okay, so you notice whoop that the screen is kind of kind of, you know, has a position on where my characters are. So, you know, where I'm standing right now, the screen is kind of offset to the right. That's so, that's so I can see what's to the right. You know, but sometimes it pushes my character, you know, it, well, the, the screen location compared to, oh, oh, wait, what? Is that the only spot that does that? That was weird. Anyways, um, whoop, whoop. Just go under. Don't, don't hurt me. I, I saw what I was doing just as I did it. Oops. But uh, yeah, I hate when the screen kind of does that thing where it's like, here's the. What? what am I saying? I don't know what I'm saying. Where it positions the screen to the left of my character, like more to the left than to the right. And so I can't see what's going to be coming from the right. And it's annoying and it causes a lot of difficulties for me, you know, where I will get hit by things that I can't see. And that's bad game design, in my opinion. You know. And the thing is, you know, with Rare, 
this isn't the first platformer that they've made. You know, a lot of people think, you know, oh, Donkey Kong Country was like the first game that Rare made. No, they go way back. Uh, their first platformer, a lot of you might know, is called Battletoads. Hey, I think, I think a lot of people, you know, well, a lot of gamers who watch this video, if they're, if they're around my age, which is, oh, what? That's dumb. I totally grabbed onto that rope. Anyways, yeah, a lot of gamers who are around my age uh, know what Battletoads is. It's billed as one of the hardest games ever made. And the reason it was hard is because of bad game design. <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna mince words here. It was because of bad game design. Like, uh, it had broken screen scrolling. It's multiplayer. Holy crap. Uh, slowdown was terrible to the point where it would kind of glitch certain things. Uh, it kind of glitched things out of existence. And yeah, they are just... They played with a lot of things. They, they wanted to, you know, make some very innovative game. And, you know, it kind of was, but a lot of their design choices I'm not a fan of. You know, they don't... Oop, 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 oop. These bees. I see bees everywhere. Not in the eyes. They're in my mouth. They're in my eyes. No! That was my Nick Cage impression. It's about as much emotion as he gave. <laughs> I'm totally not phoned in. Uh, I don't care about secrets. Yeah, the hitboxes on these guys are weird. Sometimes, like, I totally just ran right into that guy's side. And it... It hit him. I don't know how. Oh, great, we get another one of these levels. This is... This level is not... It's not bad, but... It can be annoying. Those those rats on wheels chase us. I know they're beavers, but whatever. They're rats to me. And somebody's gonna yell at me, being like, "Hey, why are you making fun of beavers? They don't—they're not rats." And you know what's so wrong with rats too? They're—they're they're clean creatures and blah 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 blah. I don't. <laughs> I mean, you know, not a popular thing to say, I guess, but I'm not going down. I know there's a secret there. But, whoop! Yeah. Yeah, it's not a, it's not a popular thing to say that I don't care. Whoop! Why did I duck? Because I hit down by accident. And it caused my character to duck. That's how it usually works, right? Whoop! Ah! Uh, oh well. Huh. No! Ah, oh, my act of trying to despawn that that wheel. I respawn that croc. Good. Oh well. Fast levels are fast. I'm not. Whoop! Come on, come on, come on. Come on. But, yeah, there's always going to be somebody complaining about something, you know, that's, that's just the nature of humans in general. I jumped, I jumped off the tire, why are you being so mean? Ugh, speaking of tire, I'm really tired. <laughs> Ugh. I'm starting to get tired, but the show must go on. I'm not going to stop until I finish with this recording, and I'm going to be as entertaining as I possibly can, which is, might not be that entertaining in the first place, but, eh, oh well. Eh, okay. Oh, I see you. I see you. 
Oh, I thought I was gonna get hit. Well, I should not say stuff like that because then that stuff happens where I get, I just immediately get hit. So, yeah. Oh, here's the ostrich. Uh, he's an okay dude. He's, whoa. Nope, nope, nope. I mean, he's, he's good. Wait, what? What was that? Why? Whatever. Oh, no! Oh, well. Goodbye. Guess I'll never see you again. Yeah, these, these, these apes. I was about to call them monkeys, but they're not monkeys, they're apes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Can I make it? Yep. Yeah. And I get an extra life, too. So that, that secret was worth it. You know, didn't do anything that make me, that made me go, want to kill myself, I guess. I shouldn't say that. You know. But, oh, uh, we get another water levels. Oh, the water levels. Now, you probably know and understand the contempt that a lot of people have for water stages. And I'm w among them. I'm among those people that, are, that hate water levels. Because, I don't know, they just never really do it right. And I think Donkey Kong Country, the, the Donkey Kong Country games are the closest that they get to actual good, in my opinion, water stages. But there are still a few that are like, what are you doing? You know, there's constant death traps everywhere, the controls aren't really that smooth. Oh, that was my fault though. Now. Okay, come on. Just swim through the sharks. No need. To oh, what? That totally didn't hit me. I if meh meh. I'm I'm whiny. <laughs> I'm trying not to be whiny, but I totally didn't hit that thing. I went through it. Ugh. Whatever. But yeah, the swimming in this game in particular isn't good. Well, not great at, at the very least. Not great. It still... It still has some issues with control. You know, like vertical movement is still meh. It doesn't do it that well in my opinion. You know, you can... if I swim... Oh, what? That's dumb. I need to pay attention now, because... Okay, there's the exit. Good! We weren't stuck on that stage for long. Yeah! Clam City. Yeah. <laughs> uh, innuendos. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna... Well, I'll try not to. I'll try not to be that guy that makes all the innuendos. Oops. Too soon. But I will make them occasionally, because honestly, that's who I am. That's who I am as a person. You might not like it, but oh well. It's not my job. Well, it is my... If I'm on here trying to entertain, it is my job to make people like me. Yeah, but... Ah, uh, I don't know. Whoop! I almost got hit. Okay. Easy boss is easy. Easy boss is easy. Yeah, the bosses in this game aren't really much to talk about. They're... Okay. But yeah, so we're gonna go on to Gorilla Glacier. Snow Barrel Blast. Oh, I hate this level so much. I really do. I'm not waiting for that. There is a secret up there. I'm not... And I could have gotten it by waiting for the vulture. The very, very slow vulture. But I'm not going to... How? I hit it. Uh. Oh well. Let's try not to get stuck on this. 
because these the later stages in this game get hard and not for the greatest reasons either some of them are just downright mean with enemy placements and stuff like that and yeah oh and blind jumps and just not being able to see what's ahead of you which is a problem that I think gets fixed in like the sequels I don't remember uh, I you know I because I have I played I played through two quite a bit I played through it a lot uh, three on the other hand I've beaten it a couple times not too much okay why does this barrel do this boom okay good yeah but yeah so the difficulty curves in the other games aren't as big uh, they're still they are still a thing you know not saying that they have no difficulty curves because they do get quite they can get quite difficult but not for the wrong reasons you know where you know blind jumps and and eh, bad enemy placements and stuff like that and I've shot myself off the edge of the world yeah Whoop. oh well I didn't need those bananas anyways I'm an I'm a gorilla gorillas well they do they eat bananas I mean they eat fruits I know that so bananas could be one of those things but yeah it's one of those things where it's like is it just, is it something that's actually real or is it made up by like game designers to make it more relatable I, I, I don't know what, what you call that uh, oh boy oh boy whoa <laughs> okay um that barrel appeared out of nowhere oh I hate this I hate this hate this so much. Why does it do it? It makes it... Ugh. In my opinion, this is one of the hardest stages in the game because of these spinning barrels. And... No! I... Uh, trying to shoot at a diagonal. Ugh. I hate these spinning barrels. And they're not... Uh, they're not... They're not good. And I just slid off. <laughs> Where are I'm glad this is at the end of the video because, oh boy, because at least we had a pretty fruitful first part of the video, you know. But oh, uh, I'm not gonna stop till I finish this level. There has to be a shortcut to these. Uh, uh. No, why are you doing that? Okay, come on. I mean, it worked out that time, but still. Ugh. I know I... <sighs> come on, I... Mm. Yeah, this is... Thank you. Now, let's just go a little slow. Let's go slow. You know, I was kind of speeding through the other stages. Oh, boy. Yeah, but let's, let's go slow. I don't want to... Thank you. Exit. Thank you. Oi. That was a level. Um, so, yeah, I will stop the video right here. Next time, we are going to continue this world. Hopefully we won't die as much as that first stage, but in my opinion that first stage was really like the first really difficult stage in this game. So anyways, thank you all for watching. This has been NephilimJD, and I will see you next time. Take care.